All right, guys, now take a look at this. Look at that. Nice and juicy. Three, let's go! Hey guys, so today I'm gonna show you how to make the best tasting steak ever. So let's say you wanna impress your girlfriend or some girl that you like and you wanna let her know that you know how to cook. So total this probably cost me under $20. I picked up this Angus beef uh, New York steak, thirteen dollars. Some asparagus if that's not your thing. I also picked up some potatoes. What you're gonna do is just take your steak out and let it get to room temperature, and that's just so it could cook like better. You know, you have a room temperature. You don't throw it on the grill when it's really cold. seasoning these sorry if this is a bad angle for you guys but force that on the lady record me we got so black pepper Put a little bit of that on there season both sides make sure you cover it up pretty good and then I got Himalayan salt That's literally it. And we're just gonna let these sit for about 30 minutes or so. Get to room temperature. Now that those are sitting for about 30 minutes, we can get started with the potato and the asparagus. Basically, we're just gonna cut these ends off. Chop them off, thicker ones. Just pick out whatever you want. Alright guys, so I have an air fryer. I don't know if you guys don't have an air fryer. You could use yeah, you could just do this in the oven. Same same steps, literally. I'm just gonna place these in there. Same goes for these, we're just gonna put a little bit of olive oil in there. Alright, now we 
We're just gonna throw these in since they take the longest. Well, it's kind of harder to hold them right it up to uh, 20 minutes. Right, since I don't want to wait, I'm just going to pull this out and just throw the potatoes on there. All right, now halfway through, just be sure to give it a good shake. What you're really looking for is like, you see that one right there? See how it's like nice and brown around it? That's what you're looking for. Skillet like this. If you don't have that, it's fine. Just use a regular pan. But really what this is for is just so to keep the heat all even. So we're gonna crank this up to all the way. Right there. It's gonna make a lot of smoke, so if anybody gets mad, just tell them cooking some good steak. Four minutes to get really hot. Go ahead and pop this out. Don't cook all the way through, so I just give it another shake. And just put about five more minutes. Right there. Now, time for the steak. Go ahead and put your oil. about a one minute each side if you want it uh rare probably like and you can just feel it too on top of that let me show you how i do it now that's cooking get some butter Now that a minute passes, we're gonna flip it. Look at that. It's also done. We're gonna pull that out. Now these should be done. Just get the sides a little bit. Check these out right here. Look at that. Yeah, still a little bit pink right here. Get that like that. Alright, now we should be done. Alright, so now that the steak is done, you let it sit for another five minutes and bam, it's perfect. Alright guys, now take a look at this. Look at that. This is juicy. Let's test that. Yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. As you can tell, I did that pretty fast. Under 20 minutes. So yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, like, and subscribe, and...